When you study engineering, your laptop stops being just a simple computer for taking notes and becomes your operations center, your most powerful calculator, your virtual laboratory, and often the lifesaver that gets you out of trouble before a deadline. It's not enough for it to be fast for browsing or doing assignments, it has to smoothly handle demanding programs like AutoCAD, SolidWorks, MATLAB, or Revit, and do so without making the fans sound like it's about to take off. And, above all, without performance dropping halfway through a task. The problem is that, with a student budget, you can't just go for the most expensive one and call it a day. The key is finding that perfect balance between power and price that lets you work smoothly throughout your entire degree. In this video, I'm bringing you laptops that meet exactly that requirement and that are among the best options you can get in Europe, all with their recommended configurations for engineering. All links are in the description. Let's get to it. The Lenovo LOQ Gen 9 configured with Ryzen 7 and NVIDIA GeForce RTX 4060 is an ideal option for mechanical, civil, or industrial engineering students who work with advanced 3D modeling, high-quality renders, and demanding simulations. The RTX 4060 significantly reduces rendering times and allows you to handle complex models without performance drops, while the Ryzen 7 processor delivers sustained power during long work sessions. The high-performance cooling system keeps stability even under heavy loads, although it generates some noise and heat when pushed to the limit. Battery life is short due to the combination of a powerful CPU and GPU, so it's best suited for working near a power outlet. Both the RAM and SSD storage are upgradable, making it easy to extend its lifespan and adapt it to the needs of your degree. This is a laptop that offers the power needed to tackle any engineering project throughout all your years of study, as long as portability isn't your top priority. Next is the HP Victus 15 configured with Intel Core i5 and NVIDIA GeForce RTX 3050, a very solid option for students of architecture, industrial design, or engineering who work with medium complexity 3D modeling. The RTX 3050 offers enough power to smoothly run programs like SolidWorks, AutoCAD, or Revit, and the i5 H-series processor ensures good performance in calculations and multitasking, even with several demanding applications open. Its discrete design and moderate weight make it comfortable to carry to classes or presentations. Battery life allows you to work for several hours, but for a full day away from a power outlet, you'll need the charger. The cooling system keeps temperatures stable and noise at moderate levels, making it viable for use without disturbance in libraries or quiet environments. A plus is that both RAM and SSD storage are upgradable, making it easy to extend its life and adapt it to higher level courses. Overall, it's a laptop that balances the graphics power needed for 3D with a good daily use experience, ideal for completing your degree with confidence. Then we have the Lenovo IdeaPad Slim 5 Gen 10, configured with Intel Core i7 and integrated Intel UHD graphics. It's aimed at students of electrical, computer, or electronic engineering who mainly work with programming, calculations, numerical simulations, and 2D design. The i7 processor offers fast, stable performance in calculation and multitasking tasks, allowing you to handle demanding projects within this profile without slowdowns. Its slim, lightweight design, along with outstanding battery life, makes it comfortable to carry all day between classes and libraries. Noise levels are very low and heat is well controlled, even during long intensive use sessions. The RAM is soldered, so it can't be upgraded later. That's why it's best to choose the right configuration from the start. Although it doesn't have a dedicated GPU for heavy 3D, it's a reliable and efficient tool for students who prioritize portability, battery life, and stability in daily work. Now to the Acer Aspire 15 configured with Ryzen 7 and integrated AMD Radeon graphics, a laptop designed for chemical, environmental, or industrial engineering students who work with medium complexity simulations, large data sheets, and analysis, but don't need a dedicated GPU. The Ryzen 7 processor offers solid performance for multitasking and demanding calculations, maintaining smooth operation even with several programs open. It's a quiet device with good thermal management, although under maximum load you may feel some heat on the keyboard area. The screen is its weakest point, with limited brightness and color reproduction, so it's not the best for visual work requiring high precision. The build is simple but durable for daily use. Storage can be expanded, although the RAM is soldered, so it's best to choose from the start the configuration that will last your entire degree. Its CPU performance to price ratio makes it a smart choice for those prioritizing computing power and reliability, 
without investing in graphics capabilities they won't need. Next, the Lenovo IdeaPad Slim 3 Gen 8, configured with Intel Core i7 and integrated Intel UHD graphics, an ideal option for students starting engineering with a tight budget but wanting a powerful processor to handle calculation, programming, data sheets, and 2D design with ease. The i7 offers very good performance for demanding tasks within this profile, ensuring smooth multitasking. Its chassis is lightweight and easy to carry, and both noise and heat levels remain low in most situations. The big advantage of this model is that the RAM can be easily upgraded, allowing you to buy it with a basic setup and improve it later, adapting to increased demands in higher courses. It doesn't have a dedicated GPU, so it's not suitable for heavy 3D or complex renders, but it is a reliable, versatile tool for the entire academic cycle in engineering fields where graphic work is limited and processor performance is the priority. Then we have the Asus VivoBook 15, configured with Intel Core i7 and integrated Intel Iris Xe graphics, a well-balanced laptop for computer, software, or industrial engineering students looking for a lightweight device with good battery life and capable of handling programming, data analysis, 2D design, and light 3D modeling. The latest generation i7 processor ensures agile performance in multitasking, while the Iris Xe offers a notable leap over other integrated graphics, allowing smooth work in moderate graphic tasks. Its slim design and low weight make it easy to carry to classes and libraries, and battery life is enough to cover most of the day without a charger. Noise levels are very low and heat is well controlled, ensuring comfort during long work sessions. Both RAM and SSD storage are upgradable, making it easy to extend its lifespan and adapt it to advanced course needs. It's a versatile option for those needing a fast, portable laptop without sacrificing the ability to handle medium-level visual work. Finally, the HP 15FD 0163NS, configured with Ryzen 7 and integrated AMD Radeon graphics, aimed at environmental, chemical, or industrial management engineering students who prioritize solid performance in calculations, large data sheets, and multitasking, without requiring a dedicated GPU for advanced 3D. The Ryzen 7 provides enough power to handle demanding applications within this profile, maintaining smooth operation even with several programs open. Its design is sober and professional, suitable for academic environments and presentations. Thermal management is stable, and noise remains low, allowing comfortable work in classes or libraries. The screen, while functional, has limited brightness and color reproduction, so it's not the best for graphic work requiring high precision. It includes 16 gigabytes of RAM from the start, a great advantage for ensuring multitasking performance throughout the degree. SSD storage is upgradable, adding long-term flexibility, Overall, it's a reliable, durable option for those needing a fast, stable laptop for general academic use and moderate technical tasks. In short, it all depends on what you'll need in your degree. If you work with heavy 3D renders and long simulations, go for a laptop with a dedicated GPU like the Lenovo LOQ Gen 9 or HP Victus 15. If portability and battery life for programming or 2D design are your thing, the Lenovo IdeaPad Slim 5 Gen 10 is a great choice. If you want something affordable with the option to upgrade later, the Lenovo IdeaPad Slim 3 Gen 8 is a smart investment. If you prefer a powerful processor without paying for a dedicated graphics card, the Acer Aspire 15 or HP 15 FD 0163NS will suit you perfectly. And if you want a versatile, lightweight laptop with more capable integrated graphics, the Asus VivoBook 15 is an excellent option. All links with the recommended configurations for engineering are in the description so you can compare prices and see which fits you best. If this video has helped you, give it a like, subscribe, and turn on the notification bell so you don't miss the next guides and recommendations. See you in the next video.